Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. We are here to check out the second episode of Hige Hero, which the first episode in like just for this series in general, I, I really didn't know what to expect, but I, I guess whatever expectations I had, the, the first episode it exceeded my expectations to, to say the least. I really enjoyed the first episode and I, I kind of like what we have going on here. And, and I'm curious to see how this progresses or how this goes. Uh, forward into the series like are they gonna actually go down a romantic route or is I mean I guess Yoshida even if it does go down a romantic route like Yoshida could still be there to see Sayu kind of live her life how she should live her life because from what we heard about her life in, in the previous episodes not how a high school girl should be living her life uh, to, to say the least and whenever we get more into that I'm not ready for that uh, to get more kind of what's going on with her family situation and just who knows what else uh, they might go into. But for now, we're here for episode two. We're going to see what we have with it, everyone. Let's get into it. Here we go. Pretty sure. Yeah, I was about to say, pretty sure that's for her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that was me. That was probably, the, you know, that was all of us at, at one point. I mean, even an adult, it's rough. Like, come on. She threw it in the ocean. <laughs> But in this day and age, right, like there's a lot behind this that really, it really isn't what it is. Right. That's what we're trying to, that's what we're trying to get at. Dialogue Plus. I saw Unison Square Garden on there too. Like maybe for the lyrics or something they wrote. I like this though. <laughs> Carrying all that shit. Why are you so nice? Hey, right, you can't just do that and say, never mind. <laughs> Stop being weird. I, like, I'm not stupid. <laughs> You're nicer than anybody I've ever met. She's just been with scumbags, apparently. Yeah, maybe, I guess her family, too. Those smiles are just a habit now. That's like, she's only a high schooler, dude. And that became a habit. That's so, it's so fucked up. It's a process. But hey, this is a step, uh, a start in the right direction. Oh. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, he was like, he's like, oh, like, what is this? You gotta work extra hard. <laughs> and the food too, and the cooking. <laughs> Why are you asking that? You trying to, you want the man fired or something? Oh, okay, maybe she don't want that. All right. <laughs> she definitely don't want that. She's staying late, late to fix this. Get it all, get it all right. <laughs> and he's still here too. <laughs> Is this something that Sayu made? <laughs> You're so nice. There's that again too. You're so nice, and then from from Sayu as well. He is a he's a good dude, man. <laughs> if you just keep being nice about it, right? You're just gonna keep messing up. You just keep doing the same thing. If you you gotta be a little blunt sometimes. That's what everyone's been thinking. That oh, this man's definitely got a girlfriend now. Is there is there really anybody still here? She says she had a boyfriend. Oh, I wonder if that's even still true or not. Lucky, because she wants him. <laughs> she, she's hoping that she has a chance, and she still has a chance. Man, I see already what they're. I see what they're setting up already, man. I don't know if it's gonna be a hair. Uh, it's not gonna be a harem, I don't think. But multiple interests. What's she reading? Is that Kuroko? Oh, I couldn't really tell what that was. Oh, he just got. He just gonna get her a phone straight up himself, even without her input or without her <laughs> knowing. This man really going out of his way. Like, he really don't have to do this. <laughs> or, do, or do you want that? Right. I mean, you never know. <laughs> now it's being, like, pushed down to him. Like, how the Mishima girl had to stay. And now him, potentially. But with him, it's different. Okay, there's more, like, a, I guess, comfortable kind of feeling she has being around him <laughs> front and center <laughs> <laughs> this man bro <laughs> 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 
Right, like, what's up with that? This has a whole different vibe than before he asked her out. I don't know if it's just because we didn't have much with her that to see how she actually is like. But why did you invite me here, right? Do you like? Do you actually not have a boyfriend? Like, what is it? Or it's gonna be about that? Like how everyone's been asking. Oh, so you've been paying attention to all this? Is 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 what you're saying? Are you are you jealous? Maybe. Oh, does she think it's Mishima? <laughs> you're being awfully... Ob I know you're the boss or whatever, right? But you've been awfully observant. So she did think it was them. Man, is this like a... It's like a do-over? I mean, his feelings weren't going to change like that. A boss usually isn't really that observant about the, these uh, some of these things. Hmm, she was awfully worried about that. I don't think she has a boyfriend. So now you got Sayu, you got Mishima, and you have this girl as, as potential in love interest. <laughs> Man, he had to ask that. We gonna get the... I cups even bigger than he was uh, <laughs> he was imagining or thinking, right? <laughs> He's like, fine, I'll tell you something happened. <laughs> if you telling her to stop you know stop smiling all like that, if it's not actually genuine, then you, you can't do the same. Oh. <laughs> hey, hey. The phone. <laughs> no denying it, you're gonna be using this shit. <laughs> I just bought that shit. Straight up. <laughs> so I actually did want a phone. It was right to it was right to go with that then. Oh that's on his that's on his mind right here. <laughs> Is it really impossible though? <laughs> Yoshida man. <laughs> they both did kinda bad, to be honest. Ooh, ooh, impossible! You said, man. <laughs> uh, that wouldn't be that wouldn't be surprising, even after how many times you've told her to chill. Well, may not be impossible after all. <laughs> That's definitely where it kind of seems like they're going with it. All right, next time, living together, and that's an interesting image. Or like the the preview image or whatever for the next episode to say to say the least right but this episode once again i have to say i really enjoyed what we had here with this one i liked again what we had with yoshida and sayu and the, probably though the biggest thing that stands out to me with this is how it seems like they're setting up to where there's like multiple love interests now i'm not saying he's gonna be in love with every single one of these girls or whatever they're gonna it's gonna be like a harem or something like that but it, like the mishima girl that we met in this episode she definitely has a thing for him it seems like i mean there's sayu and goto which goto she it seems like she may have been lying about the whole boyfriend thing i, I mean maybe not and maybe there's some reason like behind it. if she is lying there's some reason behind it like why she did lie i still feel like it's kind of screwed up if she is lying but she seemed like jealous as heck in this in this episode i have to say finding out that he actually doesn't have a, a girlfriend and all of that and even though you're his boss like being observant about these personal things and some of these other things you know i think she she there's something there or she has something towards um you know yoshida so that's the biggest takeaway from this episode with me is it seems like that's the route they're kind of going down and they keep saying the whole like impossible impossible like i can't fall in love with sayu that's probably where they're gonna go with it to uh, that's how it seems like to be honest but it's not just her there's other girls that have interest in in yoshida as well which he's a good man so i feel like he you know he should have girls uh definitely one girl but he should have people interested in him or like him not even if it's romantically i just feel like he's a he seems like a good guy to be around his friends or whatever the case may be so uh yeah once again uh like i said i really like what we had with this episode let me know what you all thought of this one if you guys did enjoy my reaction make sure you drop a like subscribe if you're new and i'll see you all in the next one thank you for watching peace out